One of the talking points at the press conference was obviously Ryan Martin and a potential fight with, with Garvey Kelly. What's your thoughts on that now? I know we've spoken briefly about it before, but um, you know, kind of when do you see see that happening from the point of view of your boxer? Well, it's becoming a joke now. <laughs> do you know what I mean? We had the press conference for the October show, and obviously I'd said some bits, Paddy had said some bits. Paddy gets hold of the mic, says his thing, and doesn't give the mic to me to, for me to be able to reply. He's just like, this is ridiculous. You want it all your own way, Paddy. Well, it ain't happening. It's as simple as that. Paddy's now, he keeps changing it late next year. And then he said, oh, no, it can happen in the spring. And now this latest video, I see whilst I'm on holiday, December 2006. Well, it's not happening. Simple as that. It is not happening in December 2006. Do you know what I mean? Why, yeah. why is it happening in December 2006? Because you haven't got confidence in your boxer? Because he needs more experience? And don't come at me saying they both need to do this. And... No, they don't. Not at all. It's not a history fight for Swindon. It's two Swindon boxers getting it on. It happens every week in white collar. You know, two professional boxers getting it on for a title, a meaningful title. Yeah, okay. Maybe a bit of Swindon history can be created, but let's be honest with you. Is that ever going to happen? No, it's not. So it either happens on the show in March, March the 5th, or it doesn't happen at all. Ryan wants it as soon as possible. Um... There's enough hype, there's enough build You don't have to build it up for another year. It's been talked about for nearly six months now. And if, if it's going to happen, it's going to happen, I would say, has to happen in March. December next year, for Ryan Martin, if things go to plan, should be either fighting for or already fought for an English title. No disrespect whatsoever to Garvey, because I like Garvey. Garvey's a lovely kid. He's, he's got a great personality. He's a good boxer. Can't see Garvey getting to that position in, in professional boxing. But it's not an exciting fight at all. 99% of boxing fans in Swindon already know what the result will be. I know what the result will be. I'm sure Paddy Deep Down does. That's what I mean. I, I'm not going to say anything bad about Garvey because Garvey's a great kid and I wish him all the luck in the world. Getting in the ring with, with Ryan Martin he gets knocked out clean within two or three rounds. And that's not being disrespectful. That's being truthful. Everybody says it. Ryan fought for England. Ryan fought internationally for England. Ryan won so many different titles for England. He won the junior ABAs. He won, he won everything. I don't think Garvey even fought for the Western counties in the amateurs. You know, There's levels in boxing. There really is levels in boxing. And he's just not at that level. So... You know, why as his coach, his manager, why would you want to put Garvey in with Ryan Martin? If I was there, I would not want to keep him as far away as possible. I'm bored of it. Ryan's bored of it now. Because the fight, it really doesn't mean anything at all. And now that, that may sound disrespectful. Paddy might get the <laughs> with it or whatever because he's trying to build it up to, you know, obviously there's monetary value, etc. in it. Yeah, fair enough. Sooner rather than later. Because we're not hanging around. We're not... If it had to happen, for example, in December, the only reason it would happen in December would be if it's a warm-up fight for Ryan to go ahead for something else. That is the only reason why that fight would happen in December, as a warm-up. And again, that's not meaning to sound disrespectful, but that's fact. The interest is there now, you know, and it can be built up. They're both fighting in December the 20th. Let's hope they both win, which I'm sure they will do in December the 20th. Possibly both on again in February somewhere. Great, another one. Then let's have it yeah. in March. Then it's done. Then we can move on and do whatever else we need to do with our own boxers' careers and whatever, and just move on from it. You know, talking Christmas next year, December next year. Honestly, it's a joke. It really is a joke. And I know Paddy ain't gonna like it, but that's just the way it is. I've seen Garvey sparring with Ryan. And Ryan's done whatever he's wanted to do, yeah. you know, when he wanted to do it. And that was before I even was involved with Ryan. You know, I watched it. Paddy very recently asked for sparring. It's what it was up for doing. And there's only one reason why he wants to spar him. You know, apart from it's good sparring. It, it, he wants to watch Ryan. He wants to see and this, that and the other. And, you know, yeah, we'll come down and spar. You're going to get one or two Ryan Martins coming down. You're going to get a Ryan Martins not going to show you anything. You just go through bits and pieces. Or it'll be a Ryan Martin that will come in, just smash him to pieces and won't be invited, invited back again. That's, that's what we're talking about. And it is just, it's just like every single thing. Paddy, change the record. Focus on something else, please. You know, unless you want to man up and put Garvey in the ring with Ryan on March 5th at the Oasis.
Otherwise, I'm telling you now, it is not going to happen. Unless by some twist of fate, the direction that he takes Garvey in ends up, Garvey wins the Southern Area title or, you know, or, or wins the English title or something like that. Then we'll talk. Then we'll look at it. But until that point, we'll fight in March. Get it done. We can progress with our own career. Can we stop talking and can we just pencil this fight in? Like we say, March, done, dusted. Let's fight in December. Maybe also fight in February. But then let's just work towards March because unless Garve's going to go and win a title, a meaningful title, an English-based title, before December, it ain't going to happen, I'm telling you now because we will be in a different place by then.